There comes a time in our lives where we must ask ourselves, what kind of man am I? What do I believe? These questions come from times of great peril. But today, here in this place, there's but one question I would have you ask yourselves. Will it be death or will it be glory? Today, we make our stand. There comes a time in our lives where we must ask ourselves. What so the daughter's got the plague? Oh. Oh, that's no good. I hear that's going around. Yeah. How'd you get it? A rat. Mm. Gave her one for her birthday. You gave her a rat? Yeah, she kept nagging me for a dog. So you gave her a rat? What, do I look like a made of money? I'm wearing Hessian here for Christ's sake. Oh, hang on. Here we go. You hear about those toilets in Rome? What's a toilet? Well, it's a series of pipes that flush away human waste from your home or place of business. Will you two be quiet? I'm trying to hear. Pipes? Oh, here we go again. <laughs> What's wrong with him? It's his first one. Hey. What's your name? Sean. Look, Sean, I've been to plenty of these things. There's nothing to worry about. Right, guys? Yeah, nothing to worry about. We're right up the back. All these guys down the front would have to be brutally hacked to pieces before we have to worry. Yeah, I guess you're right. That's reassuring. Archers! Got to put the bins out. You know what's a strange turn of phrase? Get my goat. What does that mean? That really gets my goat. That guy really gets my goat. I've got eight goats. Look, I am sick of you two crapping on. I, like many of us here, am just trying to hear what's going on. We're here to fight for a cause. And I would like to know what that cause is. So you don't know? Well. Yeah, yeah, it's about the thing to do with France. France? Does that look like the French standing over there to you? Well, I don't know. I saw one of them eating a croissant. Do you know why we're here? No, no. Not, not really. So no idea? Well, just a good weekend away with the lads, really. <laughs> a weekend away? That's it? <laughs> Maybe a sneaky mug of ale or two, eh, boys? Look, some guy gets up, tries to inspire the troops. He sends the first eight rows in to get their bowels splashed out all over the ground. He yells retreat, we go home. No, this guy's different. He's got ideas, a new direction, a, a great health plan. We've heard it all before. They're all the same. They may preach a different message at each battle, but when it comes down to it, they all want the same thing. Power. And the lady. Seriously, anyone can do what he's doing. It's just giving the audience what they want. <laughs> you reckon? I'd like to see you do better. Yeah, all right, I will. Don't be stupid. That could be interesting. Right. <clears throat> Shit, sorry, excuse me, guys. Guys, guys. Sorry. Sorry. Um. <clears throat> Why do we stand here for this guy? Who is he? What does he do for us? The little people? The guys up the back? Nothing, I don't think. No, oh, nothing. We come out here, waste our weekend to stand in a field and hope not to get killed. Well, I think that's shit house. Shit house. What has he ever done for us? You know, I hear in Rome, right now, they've got pipes that flush away their shit. What do we got? Just a bucket in the corner of our mud shacks. Well, I say, bugger him! Bugger him! Bugger him and his cause, whatever that might be. As I'm just like the rest of you, 
I just want the shit piped out of my house. No more shit. No more shit. Shit. No more shit. Because no I'm going home shit. to sit on my ass. No it's the weekend shit. for Christ's no sake. No more shit. No more shit. No more shit. No more shit. Are you ready for glory? Judge!